We hereby present the 2012 version of Candegabe algorithm, outstandingly modified to improve its application. It's of high importance to enter the objective data you may know about the patient, being absolutely indispensable to fill in the corresponding grid. Let's go over the different links and fields. From the home page, we enter the system by clicking the link Candegabe algorithm, placed on the site's upper left section. On the upper right side, we find the button's control panel for the algorithm's use, for both human or animal. Under the button to see initial instructions and the slot for subscription. On the upper left side, we find the grid to enter the patient's data, for example, name. For example, Maria Dolores Amelia. Last name, for example, Rodriguez. Name normally used, for example, Dolores. Initials, first letter for each of the names and last names, for example, M-D-A-R, in this case. Date of birth, for example, September 26, 1986. Note. On some occasions, the person feels identified not by one of the first names, but by a nickname, which replaces in importance the actual first name. In this case, if the said nickname is transcendent enough and historically relevant to her identity, it will be entered in the field identifying name, replacing the first name. For example, if Maria Dolores Amelia Rodriguez were currently called Piki by everyone since she was a child. Data should be entered into the console chart without accents or symbols. The text must be entered with corresponding bare and simple letters. Do not add letters with commas or symbols. Once all the patient's data have been entered, you must click Perform Study and the system will request you to check all the entered information so that the study will be precise and will not deliver wrong results. Once the information has been checked, you must click OK so that the technical department may process all the information and load up the study results. Let's perform the consult for our example case and results interpretation. In the following page, we see the algorithm study for our model patient, Dolores. We should emphasize the importance of consulting the algorithm together with the classical clinic homeopathic story. The latter one will determine the choice of the remedy. Under no condition at all does the algorithm study replace the classical methodology for taking down of the case. Quite on the contrary, it only enriches it. In the 2012 version of algorithmic study, you will be able to bury any of the patient's data, except for the date and place of birth. This new option will allow the homeopath to perform more than one study per patient, if there were any doubt about any entered data. With the option Update Results, the new exercise will be carried out. The study enhances primarily on the upper left side the impregnants meaning an approximation to the percentage degree of the patient's tendency towards one of the realm's structure, mineral, vegetal, and animal. By constitution, every living being falls ill according to the characteristics of an established order by one of nature's realms. We will only take into consideration mineralia, vegetalia, and animalia realms. In the present day, both of the latter ones have suffered divisions, which will not be considered for the time being. For example, today's fungi realm is contained in the vegetalia realm as well as bacteria within the animalia realm. In the same way, this tendency has been considered only as a percentage value given the scarce amount of substances that have been tested as opposed to the diversity of substances still not experienced. The realms are highlighted by colors. Blue for animal realm. Green for vegetal realm. Red for animal realm. Some of the remedies do not belong to neither of the three realms. 
For example, Luna, magnetis poli ambo, ferrum magneticum, and neither are the contained in the pregnancy. Therefore, a new color has been created for them. Gray, for imponderable remedies that cannot be taken into account for the impregnant study. Some remedies, by their constitution, belong to more than one realm. Therefore, they will be highlighted in two colors. The following options have been added to the 2012 version of the algorithm study, such as see the dynamic and symmetry interrogation. So, here you will be able to analyze on one side the patient's existential dynamic for a better comprehension of the case and on the other side the interrogation showing the questions that have to be made to establish a consonance bond in the keeping with the deepest nature of the individual, mostly if the impregnology theory will be applied in the therapeutic process. These questions are aimed to interrogate the nature lying deep within the patient, so that the answers are obtained from a far-off level of consciousness. Thus, this conducted interrogation will trigger information. After this, the study shows a list of remedies in hierarchic order according to the mathematic similarity range determined by the algorithm, according to the entered patient's data. The range is from MSR9 to MSR2. The MSR9 owns the highest hierarchy and the MSR2 the lowest one respectively. The first column at the left is highlighted in the color corresponding to the realm that each remedy belongs to. Blue for mineral realm. Green for vegetal realm. Red for animal realm. Gray for the imponderable ones. Some remedies belong to more than one realm, so they will be highlighted in two colors. In the 2012 version of algorithmic study, a fourth column has been added showing with a blue button the consonants, standing out those remedies in the list that are mathematically consonant with certain data of the patient that add a new value to the hierarchy range. Going through the remedies, you must interpret the study results in the following way. The first step is to consider the impregnance. We advise you to read through the remedies in accordance to it, from the highest MSR up to the lowest MSR, comparing them to the patient. Second step. Compare all the remedies shown in the MSR hierarchy, from those of higher range to the lowest. In our model case, we should primarily consider if Lac humanum, Memphitis putoris, or Tuberculinum are close to the dynamic image of Dolores' lack of harmony, given that our patient's impregnance throws a greater percentage of animal information. If the previous correspondence were not satisfactory, we should compare all the remedies according to the hierarchy shown in the second impregnance percentage. In our case, vegetal. In the same way, if this were not satisfactory, we should keep on comparing with the remedies of the third impregnance percentage. In our model, mineral, and the MSR from those of the highest range to the lowest. For this matter's sake, it is mandatory to consult the Materia Medica and compare the symptoms to those of the patient. Here we must also stand out the fundamental importance of the remedies clinical tropism relevant to the patient's illness. Experience shows, in many cases of therapeutic success having used the algorithm, the remedies tropism matched the patient's clinic. In each step, we recommend to take into consideration the remedies that might be the patient's remedy and the not well-known remedies, dismissing those well-known remedies that do not match the patient's dynamic image in the probins. The third step is to consider the consonants as a new value for the hierarchy range meaning. Among those remedies chosen by the homeopath, the one of the highest hierarchy will be the one signed out by the blue button of consonants. On the other hand, on the panel control above the list, you will be able to choose among other various options. For remedy analysis, you will be able to use the option Classic Remedies, 
the 300 historically more studied remedies, and the advanced list, more than a thousand remedies that include new provens. The case may be analyzed taking in consideration all the remedies or only those that are animal, vegetal or mineral, applying the impregnance hierarchy value. You will be able to see the key remedies highlighted by the algorithm for the case in question, meaning those remedies that the mathematical study holds as the group referrals. It has been proved by statistics in a high percent of cases that the best chosen remedy is often found among that group. In such a way, having analyzed over more than a thousand remedies, the homeopath will be able to file a study and well print in it, marking with a tick the most representative group of remedies from the initial list and among which you must stand out, the ones whose proving images resembles most to the illness dynamic of the patient. Clicking reading the algorithm results button, you will be able to read the correct application of the algorithm. You will be able to file the study with the download study and also print it. We advise to do this in every case, to be able to keep the algorithmic analysis. Finally, to perform another exercise, you must click the Perform Another Study button. In the case of an animal algorithm, we stand out the grid for the patient's data. In it, the following must be contained. In the field species, for example, dog, the animal species. This data is only for statistics sake. That's why the vet may enter whatever he finds more convenient for the given case, using the pertaining classification. Owner's name, by whom it is recognized. For example, Loli. It must be noticed in this case, the requested data isn't exactly the owner's name per se, but the name or nickname by which the animal recognizes its owner. In our model case, the owner's name might be Alberto, but Loli is the nickname by which the animal knows its owner. Animal's name. For example, black. Initials. The first letter of the owner's name and the first letter of the animal's name. For example, LB. Date of birth. For example, September 23, 1996. Sometimes the animal's date of birth is unknown. In that case, you may enter a question mark in these two fields. We recommend to enter as many data as possible, so that the study comes out more exact. For results interpretation, you must follow the same instructions as for humans. 